Dear friends, this is my tutorial 29 in VASP. So in this tutorial, you can learn how to perform CI NIB calculation in VASP. Okay. Okay. So first, what are the things you need to do? I will tell you step by step approach just to follow the instruction and uh, you can do it easily this one. Okay. So so first things so first you need to make sure that you your VASP code is compiled with VTST tools so VTST tools you can download from this website it's available is free only just you can download it and compile it with your VASP code okay that's very important without that it won't run CI NIP calculations okay so this is the first things you should do before doing uh, your NIP calculations okay the step one so this is the step one this is step one so uh, if you want to do CI NIP calculation you need to have your initial and final structures that is already optimized with the VASP structure I will show you the initial and the final structure what I have already calculated for my research so just I will show you the two files so actually the two file is this is the postcard one postcard two okay so this is the one postcard one is initial geometry postcard and two is final geometry okay so I will open and uh, this vista I will show you so this is the initial geometry okay so so this this is the initial geometry this is ruthenium and absorbed with O2 and CO so this is the one the CO OO CO intermediate this is the CO oxidation rea reaction LH mechanism the one transition state okay so this is the final state this is the initial state so we need to find the transition state for from postcard 1 to postcard 2 so okay this is the things first you need to make sure that you should optimize this with a uh, VASP and uh, you, you can take that concar and make it to postcard 1 postcard 2 okay this is the first step okay second for the second step the change the names of the postcards so postcard 1 means initial geometry and the postcard 2 is the final geometry already I told you now you have to change into the concord 2 postcard 1 or the second uh, final structure is postcard 2 okay this is the second step the, then step 3 so this is the important step so then you have to use VTST script so there are different kind of script so you have to use now here nipmake.pl okay this is the nipmake.pl is the one uh, uh, script to create the number of images so if you want to have four images then we have to do so you have to type your terminal you have to put this uh, two uh, files into the one folder into the your uh, supercomputer then go to the corresponding that folder then you can type nipmake.pl then use space and you can type postcard 1 then space postcard 2 then space for now how many geometry you want you can type only the I need here four images just I put four if you want to five you can put the five images okay that's very much four means four images okay so I, I need only four here that's why I put four images okay this is the step three after step three you have to have six folder into the the after you run this nebmake pl the folder will create that is 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 2, 0, 3, 0, 4, 0, 5 okay this is the six folder will create so in this is four four uh, four means this is the one two three four means four images what you have created here that uh, 0, 0, 0, 5 is initial structure and the final structure folders okay so the this corresponding postcard file will go to one year and the postcard two file go to five so in between five image will create transition state images okay i will show you this uh, four images for you just you can see that so this is already i did i created like this so this is the initial geometry this is the final geometry okay 
so if you open this you will find that you are a postcard file okay here also you can find your postcard file final geometry so in between one to four that uh, four uh, images will be created that images is there here just, just i will show you that images so yeah i will show you from one otherwise i will show you the all geometries this is the initial geometry so put one this is the image one this is image two this is image three this is image four this image five final structure okay so you can see here so this is the postcard initial one this is you can see the movement yeah this is the this is the four is the main the transition state e images so we are going to do optimization for this four images okay so this is the thing just minimize we will so we will see next step so here I, I already i told you the year 0005 folders are initial and the final structure respectively okay you understand that for the further analysis you need to put your uh, outcore file for postcard 1 outcore file for postcard 2 in the folders 0005 okay 0005 folder so already i kept here you can see here uh, zero zero. I have put the initial structure optimized outcar file. So this is the uh, final structure optimized uh, outcar file. Okay, you need to put you, you need to put this file to the corresponding zero 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 five folder. Everything you have to put your uh, do your supercomputer only, not outside that. Uh, okay. So then step five. Okay now you have a parent directory where you have all your uh, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, directories okay you have one parent directory inside that the all you uh, sub directory will be there okay so now you can uh, add your in car k point and port car files and submit the job using the, your script file okay so that's all so that's all uh, but this time you have your file will be little different from what you need to do nib tags on it okay so this is the sample in car files here i the following just you can see so this is the in car file for uh, ci nib calculation just you already i told you many times uh, for a uh, scf calculation optimization there is a little different just you can uh, see the here i think mostly here there is no difference up to here i think this is a default like what you are doing optimization the same thing will be there here so here you have to change little bit okay so if you are doing uh, optimization 10 to the power of year 0 05 just to change into 0 06 if you are doing your 0 0.02 just to put 0 0.03 here okay then only it will easily converge otherwise it take a long time very difficult to converge okay I, uh, I usually use like this only my friends also told me you can use like, like this this is the best way to converge your system like that they said so this is the very important just you can keep in mind so then water walls and uh, magmum and yellow orbit tag also is there so if you want to have uh, water walls interaction just you can uh, uh, keep it active removing this uh, uh, hashtag okay so if you want lr bit or uh, magmum i think i did not see many people will use for uh, ts for this one so if you want you can use i also no idea about or to or want to use or not uh, just if you want you can use that is the fine okay so then important thing is this is the one for your uh, ci nib calculation so end right you put zero okay this is the important this is the six tax is important for a ci nib then images four so already i we have made it four images only here you can see only four images then you have to put here images four number of nib images between fixed endpoints okay four 
spring you have to put minus 5 always okay don't change into that one put 5 i chain you need to put 0 so uh, if you put i chain 0 it will nip calculation you will fill in default okay then lc limb true flap to turn on climbing image algorithm okay then i opt 0 default it use the wasp optimization if you use i opt 1 or something uh, some other things so it will change into different optimizer so i always use i opt 0 only okay then here eyebrow also i will use uh, 2 only some people they are using uh, 3 or 1 also i think 2 is is better you can use it too if you want you can change it that okay that's all this is the important uh, in call files for uh, cnm calculation then step 6 okay after uh, you so using this uh, in call file uh, in file you can submit your calculations okay after uh, some time of after over 3 to 5 hours if you if you want to see what what is the forces of uh, each images just you can run in go to the corresponding the parent directory just run neb energy pore force this is neb ef dot pl okay during the optimization you can see use the script to know your energy and forces of the images okay you you, you can check that whether it's going to complete or not okay uh, by looking at that uh, forces and finally you can see that seventh step nib results so after completion of calculation you can uh, run this script nib result dot pl so after completion of calculation then it will give outputs like a nib energy force dot file speed line dot and nib dot uh, some images dot mep minimum energy potential surface if yes and the movies xyz uh, everything will give okay so this is the main thing so i, I will show you these files so these are the web, web, website you can download in the script file so here you can go there and you can download it vtst tools okay you can check whether if you want you can check this to web website so now i will show you that uh, this kind of files so this is the inca this is the input file already i showed to you so then this is the one calculation i already completed so i will show you this is the em eps file i think we need to open with the photoshop this file so i will show you here uh, this is the nib, nib energy forces that i think this is the forces i think is converged i used it into 0 0.03 so everything is less than 0 0.03 this is the forces this is the energies okay corresponding energies of the, this one here this is the highest energy i think so this uh, you can see this is uh, highest energy this is the 76 compared to this this is the highest energy minus uh, 290.39 okay the ts ts is the this is that too. so then you can do for uh, some frequency calculation for this one you can uh, see the vibrational frequency you are getting negative or pos uh, positive frequency so this is the ts means you will get the negative frequency okay so i will this is that two only yeah? so here you see i have made it to is the transition state okay this is the transition state structure so i have created images also just i will show you so this is the ts image okay so this is the ts image so you can do it your vibrational frequency calculation so here i found that a vibrational frequency is 1 minus 170 that means corresponding that i uh, that oc interactions that okay mm, not oc interaction this oo interaction this is the living group this is the connecting group so maybe the this is the vibration frequency of uh, this OVO group okay that's all that one so so move so I will show you this one so after you put the nib results you will get these files
yeah see so this is the one two three four five six Im Im images those we are running only four word optimization only so you can see this is the ts2 this is the higher higher energy than uh, other intermediate so this is the transition state uh, images for our uh, ca inept calculations okay like that you can do it your calculation and uh, yeah it is very easy only you can do it okay so that's all i think uh, so one more things i want to tell you one important things script file so here you have to give the uh, you have to give um, so for in calculator so just 96 divided by 4 so here i am giving the 24 cores for each jam, uh, each uh, images okay we are running four images so i am giving one image 24 cores like that you have to calculate per image if you are using 20 cores also you can mention 20 20 20 uh, 4 into 20 80 core you have to mention if you are using 20 cores 24 you are using that's why i put 96 so you need to check your uh, script files okay so this is the very important so you, this is the very important point okay that's all so thank you for watching if you like my content please like subscribe comment and share and also please click the bell icon for my future updates thank you thank you for watching thank you so much enjoy next video i will tell you how to do diamond calculation thank you